if we can get some of these thoughts right, then could it be that our joy is inside what we're not utilizing? Um, envying people, envying what people have, and so you don't want them to have it, um, and you want what they have, and it, it just confuses. It's a sick, sick it, it is, but I, I loved it because it, it gave me hope, and I believe it will give the readers, the listeners hope. Is what? Where are you looking for your happiness? Are you looking for it in more money, mm -hmm. or a better job, or more friends, or a different family? All of those are just circumstantial. Mm -hmm. But but true joy is persistent. It's constant. I just have an inner joy, and that is a peace that I don't I don't think the world knows, but I, I think they long for it. They do. And so in, getting into that book of Proverbs and saying, hey, you know what? You're searching for the wrong thing, but I can show you where that true peace and happiness comes from. So we're not just, you know, thrown out the window when our circumstances go to yeah. pot. We're not moved by our circumstances. We're, we're moved by the joy of the Lord. And that, I believe it just yeah. spills mm -hmm. out when people mm -hmm. are like, you know, I want that.